LIGO is conceptually simple at its core. It sends laser beams down two long vacuum tunnels, placed at right angles and equal in length. At the end of each tunnel is a mirror, and the lasers bounce off these mirrors and return. The returning beams meet back at the origin and cancel each other out completely. No signal is detected. But if a gravitational wave passes through during this process, it slightly distorts the distances that the lasers travel. And when the beams no longer cancel out exactly, that's the moment a gravitational wave is detected. But that level of precision is like measuring the distance to Alpha Centauri, over 4.3 light years away, and detecting a change as small as the width of a single human hair. On top of that, countless sources of noise interfere with it. So the scientists built two identical facilities in separate locations. To confirm a gravitational wave, both LIGO observatories must register the same signal at the same time. And in 2015, LIGO finally succeeded. It detected gravitational waves for the first time in history. They came from a cataclysmic collision between two black holes in a distant galaxy over 1.3 billion years ago.